just got back to Utah from Iowa, 17, almost 1,700 miles on the brand new Monkey, which had 0, 0.0 miles when we picked it up. Um, this thing was a blast. Uh, we did our, our uh, break-in oil change at an O'Reilly parking lot somewhere in Nebraska. And uh, let me show you the mods I put on it before we made the trip. I needed something to mount my GPS, so I put a RAM mount there. We needed power, so we put a little cheapo WSB um, port that we connected to the battery. There you go. Um, ran those in there. I just put the Cobra Nemo on. I didn't have that for the trip. We put some adjustable levers on because the stock ones are always just a little bit uh, awkward for our hands. And we put on these because the mirrors on the Groms and, and on these we'd heard are in uh, a little bit narrow. And this, believe it or not, might be um, the most important addition we put on these uh, because we had a near tragedy that these may have helped us uh, overcome. I'll tell you a little bit about that later. But uh, that's really all we did to make our trip home. And the bikes just functioned great. We did minimal off-road and had a ball riding on the side streets to get home, seeing a lot of beautiful country. Went through uh, five states, saw Mount Rushmore, and uh, what was it, the Devil's Tower. Um, just a really, really fun trip on these little bikes. And uh, I think I can say I like it as much or more than my Grom that uh, we got rid of this last year. We both had matching Groms, now we have matching monkeys. Um, but uh, I, I love it, I love the styling. The seat is definitely more comfortable, but you still have the same problems um, with uh, baboon butt when you ride long distance on a sweaty big seat. Um, I would say the biggest concern I had about this bike through the trip were the shocks. Uh, we're gonna change those out. They bottom out just if you're a large person over 200 pounds like we are the shocks just aren't adequate for like serious riding they're fine for just pumping around but if you're actually going to go on a long road those will knock the wind out of you if you hit a big bump um, they're, they're not comfortable the pegs are also very small on your feet if you're not wearing riding boots um, those are going to fatigue your feet a little bit we did slide our handlebars forward a little bit to make that more comfortable and give you a little bit more space and that helped um, you can't quite stand up on these even with the I mean you can but it's really awkward but uh, just a awesome little bike I mean those little things are not much um, to complain about it's super quiet we had people that, are, that said they didn't hear us come up uh, when we were in campsites we never disturbed anyone even if it was evening uh, just a great little bike.